Our camera's on one man. He's been in terrific form, as evidenced by four goals in three games. Stay with us. Hello, a warm welcome, and this is the scene here at the Zignali Duna Park. I'm Derek Ray here in the commentary position, and joining me will be Lee Dixon. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Hoffenheim. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. And so the match is underway. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Roman Burki gets the nod in goal. Rafael Guerrero starts with Lukas Piszczek as fullbacks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Committed challenge. Holland. And news of a goal at the Borussia Park from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Borussia Mönchengladbach. Four minutes played, 1-0. Oh, big opportunity! Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. Well, as we look at the table, it's easy to see why there's been so much annoyance amongst the Leipzig fans. This has not gone to plan. Well, you just expect them to be in a Champions League place all the time, and they're not. They've dropped their standards right from the top to the bottom of this club. The performances on the pitch haven't been good enough defensively and offensively. Not good enough at all. And options in the centre. It might be on for them. Gives them the go. The opportunity was there, but he got it wrongly. Well, even I would have scored there. He's had an absolute nightmare. And news of a goal in the Wolfsburg game. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Eintracht Frankfurt. 15 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Marco Reis. And he might be through here. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. And firing it into the area. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Space on the flank. Crossing opportunity. Geiger. Not a particularly strong challenge. In with a chance. In it goes. The goal for 1-0. And that changes the dynamic. Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Well, back underway here. And a wake-up call for Borussia Dortmund, you would think. News coming through of a goal at the Volkswagen Arena. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Wolfsburg. 26 minutes played. 1-1. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Not a great pass. Sessegnon looks promising this and crossing towards the far post offside by a fraction Marco Reis now Holland, and he's gone into an illegal position unfortunately
Torgan Azar. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Adamian. Geiger. Now they've lost it. on toward happen Erling Haaland and the counter attack is on options available end product or not and that's it a goal for Borussia Dortmund to square things here Well, there's no better time to score just before half-time, but there's no worse time to concede. They'll be really, really fuming at each other for that. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Well, strong play here. Dabur. And options in the centre. Munas Dabur. Well, the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, there's never a bad time to score a goal, but just before half-time can be crucial. And he's got his team back in this game. What can he... The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Sessegnon. He's in control of the situation. Alert defending. Holland. It is to be a throw in. Geiger. Just a quick reminder, we've got Champions League group stage action for you to look forward to here on EA TV. It's Borussia Dortmund facing Lazio. Yeah, cup football has its own special atmosphere for me. The stakes can be really costly. Can't wait for that one. Sessegnon. Samaseku. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Substitution time it is. Oh, nice ball. Useful cross towards the near post. The crossbar got in the way. Well, someone has found the net at the Borussia Park. Who exactly? Alan McAnally? It's a second goal for Borussia Mönchengladbach. 58 minutes played, 2-1. Thanks, Alan. Could cross it in here. And cuts inside. Oh, a tremendous block. Nice. Witzel. Royce. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. And they do like to press whenever they can. Great pressure to win the ball back. Hazard! And throwing himself up the ball. Well, the fans haven't had much to cheer about, have they? But a goal here would be huge. Over it comes. 
Hoffenheim. And clears it away. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Well, impressive possession stats over the last 15 minutes for Dortmund. Their play really deserves a goal. But you don't always get what you deserve in this game. We know that, Derek. Well, it could be on for him here. Marco Reus! And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! Here's the replay, he didn't panic, did it? Decent strike, good technique, bread and butter strike, really, but it's in the back of the net. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Good physical play. And whipped into the box. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Brandt. Jude Bellingham. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax, Lee, but they ought to be pleased. Well, all the Dortmund players will be looking up at the clock. Time is slowly ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue those missed chances? They could be costly. And also in attacking position, it's not too late for them. Well, I understand there's been a goal in the Borussia Mönchengladbach match. Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Cologne. Six minutes remain. 3-2. Thanks very much as always, Alan. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Piszczek. Torgan Azar. Sancho now. It's a good Dortmund move in the making. Holland and given away by Dortmund. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Bellingham, Brandt, on to Holland. A oh, tremendous block. Great block again. And the referee blows his whistle. With that, the game is over, and it's a victory for Dortmund. Lee, how did you see it? Well, it was tight, wasn't it? Just done enough in the end, I suppose, to deserve the win. Tactically, a really good game, Derek. And the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Lee. Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad, and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is.